We have our starting hands now. So when you get done uh, at the beginning, when you're setting this up, you should. Oh, thank you. Right here. So when you get done, you're setting this up. You should end up with five of something, uh, either uh, five resources or five cards, mm. uh, some mix between the two. So I've kept two birds, and I so I end up with three resources, so five total. Uh, and that's what I have. So uh, we can uh, do Schwazi. See who goes first. Yeah. Um, let's do that. Actually, you know, we'll do. We'll, we'll poop out a cube. All right. Okay. We'll poop out a cube. That's just funnier. That's funny. There we go. Yes, it is. Because it has the word poop. Uh huh. Poop poop. Exactly. <laughs> All right. So we're going to poop out a cube. And, <laughs> and that is a Jimmy. Jimmy. Jimmy, you are the poop tonight. All, All right. right. <laughs> All right. So uh, you start with your area and you keep this for the rest of the game. This is the first player marker. All right. Um, so, uh, so we should. Uh, and we should all get an equal number of turns in this game. So if we don't, for some reason, we made a mistake. Oh, by the way, also, I, I, I didn't mention it, but should go without saying, on your turn, when you place your cube here, so now next round, you're going to have only seven cubes. And then nice. when you place a cube here, you only have... So in the last round, you're only going to have five cubes to play. So the game speeds up in the last couple of rounds there. All right, Jimmy, uh, so pick an action on your board. What would you like to do? Play a bird, gain food, lay eggs, or draw bird cards? I think I'm going to lay a bird on you gonna lay a bird, mm-hmm. but you have to be able to feed that bird. Yes, you have to pay, pay for it. Does he roll first? Oh, oh yeah. I'm sorry. Yeah, go, go ahead and start this. Go ahead and uh, roll those uh, five dice. Just give us our starting food. Oh no, you just just leave it sitting on the table. This is gonna. Uh, they, they can't see it. No, they can't see. It. Okay. Yeah, yeah. It's, they got to see it. <laughs> we want you guys to see it at home, but we can need to see it here though. <laughs> so yeah, here we go. It's kind of critical. Yeah, yeah, exactly. So let's roll them and see what we get. All right. Oh, so the one that Ooh. slashes is one of each. So you got a worm or oh, grain. Oh, that's one of each? Worm, it's not... No, no, one, the, one or the other. I'm sorry. Okay. One, one or the or. other. Okay. Either or, yeah. So it's a worm or a grain, worm or grain, and we have a mouse, a grain, and a cherry, or berries, or whatever they're called. All right. So, Jimmy, uh, so if you want to play a bird from your hand, yes, you have to be able to pay the food cost on that bird. You have to be able to feed that bird to put them in your aviary. So uh, you're still going to... And then... Take your cubes off your board because those are those indicate like when your turn's over. Okay. Yeah, and then you just put them on there, and then just and just do your action. So, which action would you like to do? If you don't have enough food to feed the bird, then you probably want to go take food and try to get food I from the bird. You can okay, great. So, so uh, place that there. Play a bird. Put it right down here. All right. Pay the. So this one takes a a worm and a grain. Worm. Worm to green. All right, so I play a worm, play a green. There, there you go. And so uh, that uh, that doesn't cause any activations because there's nothing past that, there's nothing back here to activate when it comes to play a bird. So when you play a bird, you don't activate anything. Okay, so come to me. All right, I am going to play this bird. So I got lucky here. I got a house wren, uh, which is great. So this is pretty cool. So, um, uh, so I play this bird here, house wren. I'll put my cube here for playing a bird. And that cost me one worm to feed him. And then it says on the bird, though, it says, when played, means when he comes out into the play area, uh, play a second bird in your grain or in your grasslands or your forest. And so I can immediately play another bird right now in my grasslands or forest. Do you have to be able to feed it? Um, yes, I do have to be able to feed it. Yeah, you have to pay the normal cost. So I'm going to put him right here uh, as a, a common crackle or grackle. And I am going to... Um, uh, d- 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 pay your food. Uh, pay food. Yeah, so it's a grain and it's a, his a grain and a wild. So I'm gonna pay a grain and a fish, and that is my turn. So I got two birds out my first turn, which is nice. a, it's got the two birds that you kept. Yeah, exactly. Oh, I'm okay. done. So um, I am going to also um, put a bird down. So speak up a little. Uh, I'm also gonna lay a bird down. So I would put that there, and I would pay. My three for it. Would you play the spotted toe? Spotted toe. Spotted okay. toe. All right. Okay, I'm gonna get some food. All right. And I'll draw it. the rat. All right. So just put it right here next okay. to it. Yeah. And then, and then you take a mouse. There you go. So you don't have to take the you don't have to take the dice and keep right. it. You just take it out of the tray, and that just shows that it's not available in the bird There's feeder. There's also something to do with the size of the birds that Sherry was talking um, about. Yeah, so each... That's, that's the grain grain. Okay. Yep. So the question is about the size of the bird. If you notice, each one... By the way, these birds are all awesome, um, and these are very accurate cards with the location they're at. Um, the artwork that they did on this, this was... Um, let's see. The design was Elizabeth Hargrave, and it was illustrated by Natalia Rojas, Anna Marie Martinez Armilio, and Beth Sobel. 
all women worked on this game, which is awesome. And it is, uh, yeah, so it's got a lot of accurate information. It's got the bird size in the bottom right corner there. Yeah, the wingspan, yeah. yeah. The wingspan, and it shows you the bird size there. Um, that uh, size is, it actually comes into play in some of the cards. It'll say, um, uh, play, use the predator bird, and then draw the top card of the deck. If it's smaller than your bird, you can eat it. And you can tuck it underneath. <laughs> nice. so, it's, so it's it's pretty neat though, what they did. So this, uh, so this game can also be good for trivia because, yes, there because you if you need oh, to know yeah, where the spotted yeah. owl is from, it tells you right here on the card. Yeah. So. We, we love playing trivia. We go to trivia all the time here uh, in Orange Park, Florida. We're going we're gonna to say Jacksonville because nobody yeah. knows where Orange Park is. So we're, we're in Jacksonville, Florida, and we love going to trivia here. All right, Jimmy. All right. Um, I'm going to play this section right here. So he's doing the draw bird cards. Bird cards. All right. So you can draw either one of the birds showing here, or you can tra- draw from the two decks in the middle there. You can draw two from the decks. Uh, just one. Just one. Yeah, you okay. draw one, but you draw from either one of those two decks. All right. There. Okay. So you draw one card. All right. On to me. And I am out of cards also, so I am going to go ahead and draw a card too. So I'm going to go here and draw. And I am going to take... Um, I think I will go ahead and take this guy right here. Yeah, I'll take this guy right here. Yep, okay, I'm done. Does that get replaced? Oh, uh, yes it does. Another one comes out into that spot there. Oh, the, oh it's uh, the monkey. The monkey bird. The monkey bird. <laughs> <laughs> we, have a, we have a California condor, but it looks just like a monkey uh, when you first look at it. <laughs> Alright, so I need food before I can do anything else. So I have to go here, is that right? Yep, go there. And then you have a choice of grain, worms, or berries. Uh. Take green. I'll take a worm. Okay, so I'll take one of these worm slash green ones out, and she takes a worm, and that's it. Okay. So what? If I have a if I have a bird, I want to I want to launch, and he's only in the forest. Mm-hmm. I can't put him here because I've already put a cube here. Oh no! So yeah, that cube slides down to the. Oh, it does okay. That, that, that way. Oh, this. There way. you go. So okay. it's kind of like when you're. So this is still slide, open. Yeah. So okay. Jimmy, your little blue cube, you just slide that to the end, gotcha. and okay. another one down at the bottom there. That kind of slide, it slides over. It's kind of ending your turn there. Okay. Um, you just, okay. The reason you slide them down is because when you have the activations, like when I do this action next, mm-hmm. I'm going to get to go here and activate this bird, and then oh, okay. I'm going to move okay. here and kind of gotcha. end my turn. Gotcha. Gotcha. Okay. Then I'm going to then I'm going to put out a bird. Okay. I'm going to play the spotted owl. And I have to pay two mice All right. for him. And he is, when played, draw two bonus cards and keep one. Oh, nice. Okay, so you get so two, can I look, two, no, two, two bonus, bonus, bonus cards. cards. Yeah, so you go. get two more okay. bonus cards. And so it's in-game scoring for you. Yep. So hold on to those. And by the time we get back around to your turn, just pick one you okay. want to keep. And... Jimmy. I'm in legs. Oh, not in my house. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, so, so he's grabbing two eggs, grab two eggs, and your bird can hold it with three, so put them right on her. You're good. Alrighty. Uh, it's my turn, and I I need some food for this bird I got in my hand. So, um, but actually, I want some more cards. So I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to go here and get a card. Uh, and oh, What? <laughs> I haven't even taken your card you wanted yet. No, she started moaning. I, like, uh, I, I just she... realized that I should have done something different. Oh, uh, okay. All right. So I was debating, and I realized I made the wrong move. All right. I am going to take this bird right here. I'm going to take the monkey bird, the California condor. He is my bird now. <clears throat> and, uh, yep, so I'm done. And there's no cost to that. i just slide this down. Oh, yeah. Thank you. Next one comes up. Food again. All right. What do we get? We get the... We got uh, Sprog's Pippet. That is a... Strange name, but beautiful bird. Yeah, right. so what I realized is that this uh, gets to activate, uh-huh. but I have to go here yep. in order to make that activate. Right. I should have done this because I'm going to need food a lot, mm-hmm. and rather than the uh, eggs, I okay. should have put it here uh, I so you, I could you. have gotten food. more grain yeah, quickly. That's gotcha. what my goal was, gotcha. but I, I just didn't realize that it had to be on that. Well, if you keep drawing cards, you might get another bird that will give you... You know, some of that stuff. So anyway, mess that up. That's all right. That's right. Turn. Learn. I believe it is. Okay, so this goes over here. I'm gonna put a new cube out where I want it, right? Yep. Okay, so I'm gonna go here and I'm gonna grab a worm. All right. Ooh. Getting low over there. Right, Jimmy? And that bird doesn't have a brown section at the bottom, so it's not active. Yeah, yet. yeah. And you can just move your cube down to the end then. I'm gonna go ahead and activate my bird. Okay. Uh activate your bird? What do you mean? So you want to activate this here. 
Uh, so do that, and then your bird. When you catch a food on a bird, you cannot spend it, but it is points at the end of the game. So every time you do that action, it's basically you're getting your point. All right. All right. Uh, so it's on my turn, correct? Yeah. Uh, yep. So, so okay. what happens to these eggs? Uh, so the eggs stay right there. They're okay. fine. Uh, later on, you'll use those eggs. Like when you put a bird out over here, you'll okay. need to spin an egg to put a bird out, two, two, two eggs over here. Also, there are some other bird activities. It'll say, spin an egg to do this. There's some actions that will happen. Because you can't, you can't take the lay, lay eggs action until you've got birds out, obviously, because they have to go on birds, don't they? Um, the eggs. That is correct. Yeah. yeah, exactly. So you have to have a bird out to put eggs on. Yeah, because they, they have to you be can't, able to You hold. can't hold eggs in reserve like you can food. Right, eggs. exactly, exactly. Okay, uh, I'm going to go... Insert the chicken and egg joke right here. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so I'm going to go here. So I'm actually going here, and I'm because I'm playing a bird on this row, or this column here, okay? And he doesn't cost any food to put out. Okay. He's the monkey bird, so he is out for me. Um, when played, draw two new bonus cards and keep one. So I will do that. So I'm going to draw two new bonus cards, and I'll keep one of these. Oh, so what happens now? So I, I want food. There's only one showing. What happens? I'm sorry, what's that? Oh, so now you're going for food. There's only one type showing, which is berries. You can re-roll all those. Okay, so, uh, okay. yes, I want to re-roll. Okay, so Jimmy, we, since you're sitting will you go ahead and re-roll all five of those? Sure. Sweet, okay. So I will take the grain. Will you take the grain out for me, please, Jimmy? The grain. The grain, yep. There. Yep. That's a, that, was, that was a mouse. I know, I know it kind of looks like grain. <laughs> and his bus. Okay. So Ooh, gonna, this is tough. I think I'll keep this one right. I'm going to put out this bird, the tree swallow. And that one has an activation power, but that won't apply yet, right? That's correct. Yeah. That's so correct. that will only apply when I put something over here. That's okay. correct. Yep. So and you pay the I'm paying food. the food, the worm, and the berries to put out the tree swallow. Nice. All right. Jimmy. I'm going to gain food. All right, so he's gonna get food. So take one cube out of there. You can discard a card if you want to take a second one. I think I will. Okay, so just discard and discard, discard this right here. Yep, and then just draw a um, food out of there. Draw a food item. All right, getting a mouse. I'm getting a mouse. And what else? I'm gonna get me another fish. All right, mouse and fish. So take the mouse and the fish out of the bird feeder there. Uh -huh. You have to set them off to the side. There you go. All right, it's on to me, and I need some food, uh, but I also want some birds, too. So I am going to, yep, all right, so I'm going to go ahead and go get a card. And I could spend an egg to get another card, but I don't have any eggs out right now, so I'm not going to do that. Oh, actually, you know, I should I should, I should get some eggs and do that first. All right, I'm going to do that. So I'm going to go here, I'm going to get two eggs, and yeah, I'll grab a couple of eggs here. I'll put them out on... You can put them on any animal you want, doesn't matter, or any bird you want. So I'll spread the love around just for the heck of it. You have a couple birds there. Okay. Um, I am going to put a bird out. I'm going to. Oh, yeah, I messed that up again. Yeah, I messed this up, guys. Um, okay, so I'm going to put a bird out, and I will pay my two wheat and a worm for that bird. Okay. And so. Technically, does that activate now? Mm. Or is that when what I did, go here? Where did you put her cube? You put her cube here? Oh, okay. Yeah, so yeah. nothing activates. Yep. Okay. Why did she put her cube there if she activated oh, it? Oh, actually, here. Your cube should have been here, and it cost you an egg to do that because it's in this, it's in this column. Oh, it's in this column? Yeah. Oh, then I can't do that. Oh, oh, that is correct. Yep. So here, get your cube back. Or rewind. Rewind. All yeah. right. Yeah. All right. <laughs> All right. So Jesse's going to take your turn again. <laughs> yeah, if you're putting birds okay. in the second, third, fourth, Call them anything up. It's going to cost you an egg. So you have to have eggs. If you don't have eggs, then you can't put them So I need that. to get eggs then. So that would be where? Here? Right here, yep. But then that will give you the option to activate. You'll be able to activate that bird's exactly. power. Exactly. Yes. So, yes. so you'll get two eggs, and you put them on that bird, and then you also activate that bird's power now. Okay, so that awesome. gives me a free green. Okay. Okay, I got you. I'm picking up what you're putting down now. Sweet. Okay. Sorry. Right. All right, I'm going here, and I'm getting a... Wait, so what going, is... I'm sorry, what is this card? One? Yeah. All right. Uh, do, you, do you want either one of the three showing here? Can I see those three? Um, I yes. I really can't see them. You sure can. And uh, those... That right there means that you can spend one resource to get another egg. Oh, can I do that before? Yeah, sure. Yeah, go ahead. Take another egg. Just so I have... Yep, that's fine. Because I can carry four. Yep. 
So when you do the uh, lay eggs action up underneath, you have the little, you can spend one resource to get uh, an egg. That's what Jesse did. She threw away a uh, grain or something and then got an extra egg for that once she took that action. And also activated her bird, which gave her a grain also. So Yeah, I'm going to take this one. All right. So Wes is taking a bird. And I think he's done. Yeah. Mm -hmm. okay. Jimmy? Oh, I'm sorry. The But no, I activate this, right? So this, uh, this that's correct. Goes I'm there. sorry. Yes, so yes. When uh, activated, tuck a card from your hand behind this bird. If you do, draw one card. Okay, so, so you I can just take tuck a. That's actually hand. really good. So you just draw another card. Wow, yep. that's nice. So I will tuck that one behind it, and then and so can I see what that one is. So does it say draw a card, or does it say it says tuck a tuck a card you from your hand behind this bird? If you do, draw one card. All right, so I go for it. You look at those, and oh, we're drawing from the top of the deck. I guess Jimmy can. I mean, he can. Yeah, take yeah, his yeah Jimmy. So yeah, Jimmy's going to go. Yeah, unless, unless he's taking a bird. I'm going to lay a bird down. He's laying. A, he's laying an egg. All right, no, he's not. He's laying a bird down. Okay. So that's going to cost you one egg, and, and what are the food cost is? And one mouse. Yep, a mouse and an egg. There you go. And that's it. That's it. Yep. All right. So it's on me. I am going to get um, another bird. Yep. 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 Oh, after Wes is done. So I'm going to go here. So I get a bird. Yeah, I'm gonna take this one. All right. Another one comes up, and I'm gonna take. Let's see. Mm -hmm. uh, well, I like that one. That's good. Uh, so I'll go ahead. And I'll take this one right here. Put that in my hand, and uh, this doesn't have any kind of activation, so I'm gonna keep this moves down, and I'm done. Okay. Jesse. Oh, thank you, Jim. Another card comes up. All right, now I'm going to put a bird down, right? Okay. Right there. Uh, there you go. Oh, uh, there. Oh, because right, it's a second so column. On that column, yep. And then Pain egg. Egg. Cost you one egg, and then whatever the food cost is for the bird. And then... So why is it costing an egg? Did that bird like eat an egg or something? <laughs> or what is, is it, was he hungry? Cannibalism. Because right, so you like the spotted two, he had a, had an egg, right? But he didn't lay an egg of a, a dickasil. Dick. Oh, what? What did you say? That's a dance. <laughs> <laughs> um, and di I, I'm not. I can't say it. All. I don't. I'm trying to make this a family show. I can't say the name of that. What is that? <laughs> dickasil. All right. All right. Well, there's your. Uh, your dick sickle. Put that right there. And uh All right. All right. And Wes, it's your turn. Okay. Um yeah, I'm gonna lay some eggs. So. Lay an egg, all right. Doesn't matter where you put them, right? It I can mean, go on any bird you want. Yep. Doesn't I mean it doesn't matter for gameplay. Uh that is but correct. You can only hold one egg. Now, oh that's right. Oh, oh okay. it does matter for that though, yep. Yeah. <laughs> so you put it on that one. Um it doesn't matter. There are some birds that'll say um, spin the spin an egg on another bird, and it uh -huh. may specify you know things like that. Or you can lay an egg, but it has to go on this type of nest. You know, so other than that, no, it doesn't matter. Gotcha. All right, gotcha. Jimmy. All right, I am going to um, draw a card. All right. Okay. Would you like take one of these or I top? Will grab this one? All right. Which which one did you take? What's it called? The ruby crowned kinglet. Ruby crowned kinglet. All right. So a royal bird. All right. It's on to it's me. Got a crown on its head. So. Oh. Oh, it sure does. Look at that. That's like cool. a cute. Crown. Yeah. All right, it's on me, and I am going to get some food. Actually, is what I'm going to do. So, thank you. Oh, actually, wait a second. Can I do that? No, I need food. Yeah, I need food. All right. So let's go here, and I can go. Ooh, no, I should. Or should I get a card first? Is this just random? That's just a random card. If you go there. Yeah. Do you yeah. Have, you well, can you can take, take one, one of those, those or a random. Because I that's what I did is okay, I took it. All right. Actually, I'm going to change my mind. I'm going to take a card. I'm going to take this card here. And I could spend an egg to get another card. This comes up, by the way. And so I will do that. I will spend an egg and get another card. Um, yes, I'll take this one right here. All right. Okay. And I am done. Can you put it? Oh, another one comes up. Yep. All right, so I'm going to. I'm gonna check something. When you play, a, when you do the uh, pay an egg to get on the card, and you take one from here, does the other card come up immediately or at the end of your turn? So I'm gonna check that real quick. To see. Okay. And... Oh, 
Uh, yep. Wait to the end of your turn before you refilled. So I apologize. I took afterwards, but okay, or during my turn, but I probably would have taken the same bird anyway. Yeah. So. All right. I'm gonna get some food. Uh, so I will take the fish. And then this doesn't activate, so All right. goes over. All right. I'm gonna lay another bird down. All right, that's gonna cost you an egg. It's gonna cost me an egg, and, and I get to pick either food. a worm, a grain, or a cherry, and I'm gonna spend a grain. All right. And now you activate the next. Well, actually, no, you don't. You're well, late. Actually, it says when played, play a second bird in your forest, pay its normal cost. So, do you have a card in your hand you can play? Nope. So you want to be doing that? Okay. Yeah. So if you have a, uh, that would be like you play another card. Yeah. You got, yeah. If you get two cards in your hand back to back, you're gonna play, but you gotta have the food for both cards too. So, but it says in your forest, not in your deck. Right, you play it here in the forest. Yeah, uh, it means it plays it in the top row. Okay. Yeah, I made that mistake once. I had two birds. I was on stack back to back, and it said play a second bird in your forest. But you, but, didn't the, have bur- a forest. but the bird I had was a water bird. I'm uh, like, oh, it was like so I couldn't play it. I'm like, so, yep, yep. You have to read those, and some of them say like, oh, when you do something, when you activate, lay an egg on another bird, not on this one. And I didn't have another bird out there that had a nest, so I was like, that I, that power was useless for a while. So I, yeah, you had to read those things. I made several mistakes doing that. Okay, uh, I'm going to take some food now. Um, are you going to roll or are you going to take that rat? Ooh, I can, let's see. What am I going to do here? I am going to... Um, uh, I'm going to... Okay, I'm going to move this down here. I'm going to go ahead and take some food. I need food, so let's go ahead and grab that... No, we're gonna re-roll. So Jimmy, re-roll for me, please. Sure. Just this, or no? Oh, uh, all you roll all five. Yep. All right. yep. So there's only one type of food left. It was a mouse. I didn't want it, so we're all right. And oh, that's wonderful. There's uh, not a lot to choose from there, but okay. Uh, so, <laughs> Mike was apparently looking for berries. <laughs> berries did not come up. No, and uh, I <laughs> nah. uh, did not get a berry like I wanted, but that's okay though. I, I will go ahead and choose something else. I will take. So I get. So I want a worm. And there's a choice between the single worm there or the worm slash grain. I want to give you guys less choices. Mm-hmm. So I'm going to take the worm slash grain, and then I'll take the worm that I want. So a little strategy when you're taking from there. You, if you can take Such the, a bully. If you, if you can take the slash ones with the choices, do that so your uh, opponents don't get the, those choices. Um, All it's, right. not, it's not that cutthroat. I mean, it's just a... All right, no, There's I still a like worm and a grain out there. Yeah, so. exactly. I would have done the same thing, actually. Okay, so are you done? I am done, yes. Oh, actually, no, I'm sorry. This activates my bird now. It was over here. It says, when I activate it, tuck a bird from my hand under this card. If I do lay an egg, and uh, these are all good birds. I don't want to do that, so no, I'm not going to do that. I'm going to skip over that. I like that power, but I don't want to lose these. Yeah. I've got right. some good birds I want to put out. I'm going to go here, and I'm going to grab the grain. Jimmy, mind taking that grain out and put it off to mm-hmm. the side, please? I'm doing the same thing. I'll take that worm. All right. Nothing activates for you guys? Nope. No. Mine did not have the power. All right. Jimmy. That's it. I'm out. Yeah. Okay. So that is all of our cubes. So we're done with this round, folks. Now we can do scoring on this round. All right. So uh, the scoring for this round is the person with the most birds with the stick nest that have an egg on it. All right. So does anybody have a bird with a stick nest that has an egg on it? I do not. I have none. Nope. Nope. Okay. Nope. You have any? Where's the stick nest uh, at? On the... Right he, there. He does right there. Yeah. No, but, he does not have an egg on it. All right. So none of us got stick birds with the with an egg on it. So we all, we all just said, forget the bonus. We're not going to go for it. So we all are going to put one cube on first place. Because we all tied for first. Oh, we all tied for last. Yeah, whatever we going to call it. Um, so we all tied for first here. Uh, so the only way we take the five points and divide it up evenly. So we all get one point at the end of the game for that. <laughs> Yay. All right. All right. So that's the end of round one. And uh, so now... We're, we'll take your cubes off your board and kind of reset now, and we continue around the play. Jimmy, you still go first, and uh, we'll continue taking birds. Uh, I think that's all we have to do for in-round in scoring. Wasn't that all it? That's all I can remember. Yeah, that's it for in-round scoring. So we, uh, we've determined who's won those there, and now we move on. All right, so uh, we're going to play. That's that's the first round. The second round is exactly the same. Third round, fourth round, everything's exactly the same. So what we're going to do, we're going to stop here. We're going to play out, finish out the game, and then uh, at the end we'll turn it back on and we'll go over final scoring and show you how we all scored out on the game.
All right, so we are done with the game. We have finished up, so we're going to do final scoring now. I, I'll show you what the, everybody's boards look like here. We're going to walk through it step by step. So let's go ahead. We'll do uh, Jesse first, and then we'll do Wes, and then we'll do Jimmy, and then we'll do me, all right? So, uh, Jesse, first thing we do is your birds. So you look at the numbers on all your bird mm -hmm. cards and add them all up and tell me what your score is. Wes, you can go into the same okay. So add up all your bird numbers on your card, just the number to the left of the bird. There. 25. So Jesse has 25 for birds. Wes, what do you have? 31. 31. Jimmy? I need to roll a calculator. <laughs> really? 1, 2, 4, 7, uh, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, um, 26, and what's 26 and 6? That's 31. I will double check. Double check. <laughs> I suck at math, so I could have missed one. I've had a long day. He's got 32. 32. Okay, mm -hmm. thank you. Two. All right. Your bonus cards. It's these right here. God, um, I'm so mad. I, I have Mike. Mike, what one. did you have? Oh, I'm sorry. I had 34. Okay. I had 34. I'm sorry. Yes. I had 34 of mine. All right. So, uh, bonus card. Here we go. So, uh, mine was birds with the, um, the, I think they're called, uh, cavity nest. The ones where they basically burn into a tree. You okay. Know? And um, birds with a, a bowl nest. Okay. Um, and then so mine says four, four to five birds, you get four points, and six or more birds, you get seven points. Um, so birds must have those, those special symbols on. So that's what I'm looking for on my board. And uh, so for the for the tree nest, I have I just have two of those. So that does, that gives me no points. And then for my bones, I have one, two. I only have two of those. So, I, so my bonus cards get me no points. Okay, zero points for my bonus cards because I did not get enough of those types of nests. All right, I get three. Jesse gets three for her okay. bonus cards. So I had bird counter, which was birds with a, I guess, bird power. There, the, it's that little power yep. right there. Yep. And I had four of those, so that's worth eight points. Okay. And I, I had seen that before. Birds with what? Birds with a bird power. Oh, cool. Okay. And then I had falconer birds with a. I guess, it looks like a skull and crossbones. So I'm guessing it's a carnivore. But and yeah, I only right. had one of those, so that's worth two points. So I got ten points for those. Okay. So ten points for your bonus cards mm -hmm. for Wes. Jimmy? All right, so I have the large bird specialist. So if I have four to five or six, I get points. I only have three, so I get none for that. Birds worth less than four points. Um, let's see, I got one, two, three, four, five, six. Ooh, nice. I don't know if the four is inclusive or not. Less, less than four points. Okay, so in that case, I get three points for that. Three, three points. points. Okay. And the final bonus I got was birds named after a person. And the way you figure that out is if it's got an apostrophe S at its name, I have one of those. Okay, which is so, two, two per bird. You didn't have Clark's Nutcracker then? <laughs> did not have Clark's Nutcracker. We have a friend named Clark. We're going to send a picture of the Clark's Nutcracker bird. That's, that's pretty funny. Okay, so Jimmy, how many points was that total? I'm sorry. Was it three I for one? Or... All counting that. Uh, I'm sorry. Uh, it's, it's, uh, we had five, three and five. five, yeah, five. Mm -hmm. So five points for Jimmy's bonuses. All right. Uh, end of round goals. That's the bad boys right here. So let's do these real quick. So we all tied on the first round. So that is one point each, right? So, yep. so we all get one point. Okay. Um, plus, uh, so uh, really we need to do this one person at a time here. Yeah, because, yeah, uh, yeah. Let's do that. All right, so let's go start with Jesse. So Jesse's getting one point, zero, zero, and three. One. So, one. so one. Tied. She's tied three, so one point. Oh, one point. So, yeah, so one, one, one. So Jesse's getting two points. Correct? Yep. Yep. All right. Wes is green. Wes is getting one, two, and we're splitting the nine there. So that's four. So no, we're splitting the six. We're splitting the six into three. So you yeah. take the first. So oh, 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 okay. So okay. nobody's oh, on the spot. So we yeah, yeah, so yeah. we got so we yeah. nine. We split nine. So it's four points. So it's one, two, plus four, six, six and seven. So seven. seven points for Wes on the bonuses. Jimmy, uh, you're getting one here. You and I are splitting that. That's seven divided again is three. three so so that's four, five, six, and we divide that eleven with five more. So eleven for you. Nice. And then I'm getting one. Uh, that's seven, three. so three, so it's four. Another four. No. Oh, that's you're me. red. That's yeah. right, you're red. So another four, right? It's not, yep, so. Yeah. Dang it. Well, Sorry. Give me this count, man. Sorry. <laughs> no, I'm just going to blame you, though. Uh, so one, uh, three, three, four, eight, nine, ten, and another five. Yes. Uh, yeah. So 13. 
13 bonuses. All right. No more eggs. So count up all the eggs you have. Each egg is worth one point. I have four. Uh, so Wes has four. I have one. She has one. I have nine. Ooh, nice. Nice. I have one, two, three, I didn't know egg five, six. Points. I would have <laughs> been <laughs> lock, stock, and barrel. All right. Now that your food on your cards. So, Jimmy, you got food here. I have one mouse on my card, so I get one point for that. Um, what do you got, Jesse? You have one. Okay, Jesse gets one for hers. You don't have any food nope. on your cards. So that's a zero. Six. Six points for your food. All right. And now the tucked cards. These are the cards that are under your cards. Count those up. How many of those you have? Not including the one on top. Not the one on top, okay. just the one just the ones under. Ones are actually tucked. Two for me. Six. Six for Jimmy. I got three. three. For Two for Jesse. How many you got, West? Three. three. All right, there we go. Uh, I am going to need a calculator for this one because <laughs> this is uh, adding up a uh, lot oh. of uh, larger digits here. Do, and, can we put the cards away? Or do you uh, still have them on the boards? Yeah, you can, you can put them on. Yeah. Okay. Uh, uh, actually, before you do that, does yeah. it? do we count the food in, in no. our display? Mm -hmm. Food okay. does not yeah, Food does no. not count at so all. So we can start putting the cards away? Yep, okay. sure. All right, so let's do the math. Here. I want to. All right, final scores are in, folks. Here we go. Final score. Uh, coming in uh, last place in the game, or fourth place in the game, so let's say fourth, uh, is Jesse with 41 points. Yes. 41 points. All right. How, which, which, which score last time I played? First time I played? Well, you and I teamed up, remember? Oh, that's right. What so was, I don't remember the score. Okay. I think we said, I think it was like 32 points. Okay. So we did much better this time. All right, so 41 points there. Wes, uh, 55 points in third place. I had 57 points in second. Jimmy came in first with 61 points. Woo so, yeah, those all that grain you had piled up yeah, on there, yeah, that, that yeah. six really? points, yeah, right? I mean, that was that, huge. That all was those tuck cards and that that well, added up. Yeah. He beat, he beat, really he, beat well. he beat me by he came a uh, six points ahead of me. So that was the difference. Yeah, from he, he first six, to third, six so. points ahead of you yeah. and four points ahead of me. Yeah, so. yeah. So that's a that's a big difference. All the hell is tuck. It also is going to depend on when the birds come up. Mm -hmm. You yep. know what I mean? Mm -hmm. He was just he happened to get those birds that yeah. he could stack, which was I mean he stacked them well too. So. All right, guys, we hope you enjoyed watching us play Wingspan. This is an awesome game. It should be coming out in April of 2019, so next month for us. Uh, grab a copy of it if you can. It's great. Snowmeyer Games always makes great games, and this is a really fun one. I love this game. It's uh, it's thinky. you got to really think about what you're going to do with the birds, whether you're going to use them to you know, tuck under one or go get food with them or whatever you're going to do. Um, but uh, there's only four actions, really, or five actions you get to pick on your turn. So you don't have a whole lot of things to choose from in terms of uh, actions. Uh, but yet you can still call some analysis paralysis because you're really like, oh, do I go get food first and then go get the eggs or what? You know what's available you in the birdhouse? You gotta know what order you're laying your birds out in to yeah. know how to act to know how to best get their activation yeah, powers. So. Absolutely, is it? So th those activation powers too. You want to put those out, but. Like I put, I put this on now at the bottom. It said, uh, whenever I do this action, I can. Whenever I activate, it, I can trade in one good for another. But I didn't go get a lot of cards the whole time, so I never really used that. And so it's like it's great, but if unless you're doing that action over and over again, you're not. It's not you're not taking advantage of it. Jimmy did great. Jimmy had a, a bunch of cards all stacked in a row. So when he activated that row, he activated every single one of them uh, and got a bunch of bonuses. And I made good use of it. Yeah, 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 exactly. So that was that was a, a great way to play it. So awesome. Uh, what do you think, Jesse? Um, yeah, I liked it. It's a, it's a nice uh, engine building game. Yep, I do. I like it a lot, and it's got cool um, facts on the cards, which is pretty neat because you can actually figure out where the bird comes from and what the bird actually eats and the name of the bird. Mm -hmm. So it's pretty cool. I like. I just, it. I just like how versatile it is because with a hundred some odd plus birds in the deck, and every bird kind of does something different. You know, it's you're going to be able to play this game over and over again without catching the same. You know, the same repetitive nature that some yep. games do so it's really yeah, cute too absolutely. when you fold this it looks like a little leather bound oh yeah book. it does uh, that's, cute. that's really cute and the little eggs see this is this is primo right here these little cute <laughs> eggs these are awesome so what i liked about it was the just the various options of strategy you can do like for instance a lot of you guys accumulated a lot of eggs i ended the game with just one However, I still won because I took advantage of another different strategy option. Right. Uh, tucking cards and getting mm -hmm. tucking the, cards putting and the food on top of the words. Yep. 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 And you stack those together too. So every time you took mm -hmm. that take food action, you got three actions yeah. there. It was that was just yeah, huge. You, you had a really good chain going over yep. there for sure. That's good stuff. Awesome. Well, I messed awesome. mine up. I've enjoyed it. I look forward to playing it again. Hope you guys enjoyed this. Uh, if you have any questions or comments, please leave them on the, uh, on the video in the uh, comment section. And check out our Instagram and our Facebook. And uh, this is YouTube. So you're checking out already. And our... Um, like and comment. Uh, yes, like, comment, subscribe, all that stuff. 
Um, what else we have? Oh, and Twitter. We're on Twitter now, too. So check it all out, and we'll see you guys later. Thanks for watching. Thanks for watching, guys. We hope you enjoyed this video. If you do, how about give us a like and maybe subscribe. If you have an idea for a video for us to do in the future, we'd love to hear it in the comments below. Thanks for watching.